is an ex-monastery which was built in the 12th century and this is actually the most important cultural building in our municipality. We are trying in every way to give its message forward to the future generations. It doesn't mean only building stones and putting them together, but it actually means giving content to the walls and to the site itself. But now with Epson glasses, you have the chance to actually visualize how deep this story actually is, because of course your imagination is working better with the vivid pictures from the AR. It's like a totally new thing for me, like for Slovenia. I've been in Žička Kartuzija five times and I've never seen something like this. It's a new addition and I think it's a good investment into the future. We are an, an augmented reality company. We've been dealing with the augmented reality technology for the past five, six years. We're very much specialized in cultural heritage. So we've started working with Epson about uh, three years ago, seeing that this product actually answered a lot of our needs. We think it brings a new way of giving this experience in tourist sites or cultural heritage, which hasn't been done before. We've tried different types of wearables. The thing we see with the Epson, the Moverio glasses, they're light, the picture quality is very high. It's not a huge headset. It's actually pretty close to a normal glasses that you wear. One of the more exciting features with the Epson is the fact that we can walk through the environment to actually bring to life places. So you would see an old ruined church, and then you would go inside with the glasses and see a reconstruction of it with the hearing the sound of the prayer and the monks inside the room. So this kind of puts the location in context back in time. The experience was impressive. Right here, if you look with your bare eyes, you can see only the ruins. And if you look with the glasses, you can see like the church architecture in previous eras. There is a map from uh, Žička Kartuzija, and it's really interesting because when you look at it with the glasses, it really comes alive. It's a very novel technology. People are quite surprised with this, and it is still uh, magic in a sense. We're just scratching the surface of the possibilities.